being woke, I, you know, I, I, my woke friends have told me I'm not woke enough. I have to be woker. <laughs> Some people don't even know what woke means, by the way. You know, it, 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 they don't, you know. It, see, those are woke people. They're like, yeah, I'll tell you what it means. <laughs> let, me, let me tell you what it means. <laughs> oh, it means that you're conscious of everything which is great, but it can also be annoying. <laughs> you know, I'm not woke enough. That's what they've told me. I gotta be woker. You know, Starbucks coffee, I feel guilty if I even walk in. I can't walk into Starbucks coffee. I can't get my dark roast, I feel bad. <laughs> you know, some brothers, they were arrested. They were just sitting in Starbucks, which is what you do in Starbucks. That's where you go to sit. Now I can't get my dark roast. <laughs> There's so many products that racist people is like, you just, look, Chick-fil-A. Oh, I've traveled. Chick-fil-A, it ain't stopping nobody. People are still standing in line for Chick-fil-A. Tasty chicken. They just standing in line like, this is not my issue. I... <laughs> this tasty chicken is powerful. There's gonna be nothing left. I mean, some racist people, they make good products. <laughs> you ever been standing outside? Oh, it smells so good, but they don't like me, but I just want the food. <laughs> this microphone, someone probably did something. I gotta talk like this. <laughs> just to I'm gonna be walking around naked at some point. They're gonna be like, what's wrong with her? Oh, that bitch is woke. That's what's wrong with her. <laughs> she woke as <laughs> Yeah. Mm. And I have guilt too, cause you know, like I don't talk about politics as much as I want to on stage. Cause I'm just not, I'm not good at it. And I wish I were. And I, and I realize this, so I have guilt. I have black guilt. Look, there's some white people out there, they're like, mm. I'm like, you can have that shit if you want it. <laughs> but it's happening. It's when you're black and you haven't done enough, you feel it. Like, I need to do some marching. <laughs> I need to get a good marching. <laughs> okay, it's just my allergies really been acting up. <laughs> I don't wanna be sniffling and protesting at the same time. <laughs> I'm more of a seasonal protester, you know? It's like, I was thinking maybe the fall. This joke doesn't work in L.A., by the way. <laughs> I just, I need to do more. Like, I, I wanted to go to the Women's March, the first one in D.C. I wanted to do that, but I have a weak bladder. <laughs> I knew the lines for that bathroom were gonna be long, and they were. They said they were historically long. <laughs> And when looking back in history, a picture of me just waiting in line for the bathroom. Just... <laughs> That's not what I want. Or straddling a bush because I couldn't make it. <laughs> just looking at my girlfriend like, this is our moment. <laughs> I'm still peeing. <laughs> You know, I'm a feminist. I drink a lot of water to get rid of the man. 